Just returned back from Noy's shop with some goodies, the chicken on the bones, and it's chicken bones. Hello. So, no good eating the wood. Come on. What are you after? Oh, you've got some as well. Remnants of butter stuff. You try and get the uh, chicken out of the two uh, the sticks, you know, the, the split cane, what they put the chicken in between. And they just whoa, jump up at you and tap the bloody lot. And they're certainly not ravenous. The amount of tins we buy, uh, meat we buy a week and then top quality uh, dry food. Bread was munching away over here and this little fella avocado, he went to intervene, he got a nip. Old Papa gave him a nip, said, bugger off, get off mine, this is mine. Yes, here he is, yes, and a good looking lad he is too. Awful lot of stray dogs and that lying about in fields and, well half of them are actually owned like but it bears no significance to what they are with families over here. Had a conversation with one of the subscribers about some uh, family pet that was just bloody, basically left to bloody get on with it. Gave him bloody paracetamols to take the pain away. Looked at oh, the poor dog had been split down the back with a knife or something. Like that. So, he is the Woof Woofs, mother, father and the two sons.
There's Butter, she's watching them all the time. These two, these two little buggers just get dirtier and dirtier. Look at the bloody state of you two. My bloody God. I well enjoy your playtime together because sorry little avocado in two to two and a half weeks time your new owner's coming to pick you up. He's travelling eight hundred kilometers to pick you up. His words drift away from the meaning and the sun melts the chill from my life. He's getting himself settled in as a little fella. They both are, they're enjoying each other's companies. And of course he's, he's very posh now, he's got a, a chain on and so is Brad. Looking very handsome is Brad with his chain on. Yes. Butter, well, butter's butter. It's a good dog. As I said before, they're all good dogs. Where's Minnie? In the house, looking after the pups. How they doing? All right. All ten still alive. Getting stronger by the day. Hey, it's you lot that chowing this blooming hammock. Hey, get out! I'm gonna go a bloody cropper here. Yes! Bloody monkeys! Digging, just love to dig. By Jove, it's going to have to be a, a shower and uh, spreened up before your owner comes up in a couple of weeks or so. Avocado. Yeah, they do love to play for you, they do. Butter there, what a good dog she is. Yes. Any anything, any movement over the uh, fence and that, like butter's there, like barking. Well, what we're doing today, Michael, New Year's Eve, tidying up an old family traditional thing my bloody mother did. Oh, our Michael, I'll have to tidy up before uh, New Year. You never know who's coming to the house. Uh, them days don't uh, happen anymore. Well, not very often. So, yeah, just in the dog kennels, sweeping out, just general tidying up a bit. I've got to do in this one yet. Needs a good uh, disinfecting and and that uh, for, uh, I think, about another week. And... Uh, we should have uh, the new uh, arrivals in.
the chill from our lives Helping us all to remember what we came here for